a little bit scolding I needed to do to my gardener because he's so lazy to put the plants here. And I told him, can you please put the plants here? Because the whole room looks much more tropical and prettier, right? So I told him, please put all these plants back. You just water them twice a week by bringing them downstairs and leave them under the sun and then bring them up again. That's what I just told him. Because from now on, I just want to see the plants there when I open my bedroom's door in the morning. I want to see it looking pretty. So there it is. Beautiful, right? What the difference it makes. I scolded him a bit because that gazebo was built in 1999 from the previous owner. And it stayed so beautifully maintained until, okay, I needed to have it repaired in 2012. So I had it renovated, changed everything. And then I came back this time, 2017, December. It's all gone, kaput. So just now I told him that he doesn't maintain, only the grass he maintains, but he doesn't take care of the welfare of the, of the, of the plants and garden. So now he understands, I hope. It's Monday morning today, 5th of November, 2008. Let's check the development of this Bougainville crawling in between the bamboo trails of Tanya's bathroom. So far, so good. So far, so good. Let's hope it's going to grow abundantly over these rails. So I found this uh, concoction of uh, different spices of, uh, let's say, um, nutmeg, cloves, ginger, a little bit of uh, black pepper, which is not good for me. But when I drink this tea, it's quite good. Well, it's tea, let's say, but it's nothing to do with tea. Um, cinnamon and sugar and also galangal if you know what it is is like the younger version of ginger so I have this now before I go to bed not that I go to sleep right away uh, but I'm going to use only half because it's too sweet for me from also going to add green tea in it one and then let's pour the hot water in and leave it for a few minutes <laughs> now I'm gonna take to my bedside and have a sip so I found this yesterday and I prepared it with the white coffee they have here because sometimes I don't want to drink twice cappuccino that is made of um, organic almond milk or soya milk because it's quite pricey here so this is a very economical way to at least taste the the goodness of a coffee 
and I had it mixed with the white coffee it's called here and it's so delicious and this is coconut latte it's really really delicious I'm very happy with this discovery and purchase this is another serving of Indonesian food and we call this pickled spicy with turmeric vegetables and this one grilled chicken again with chili sauce grilled together with uh, either ginger or without ginger also that's okay but normally as an Indonesian you should at least have three dishes to be served with the staple food white rice which is organic and but since I'm alone two different dishes is already more than sufficient for me so this is another lunch that I'm going to have now and not necessarily with fingers every time you eat we eat with spoon and fork that's how we eat with spoon and fork not with knife so you scoop your rice with spoon and it's not for soup all right that's it for today rice is back to green again and lush looking so lush but it just finished rain and it just finished raining and then it's cool it feels cool in this part of Jakarta which is actually the outskirt of Jakarta is cool it's a bit chilly so funny okay I'm going upstairs again continuing working online just finished my lunch hi again just woke up it's already 25 to 6 p.m. dosed off maybe like an hour ago fell asleep and uh, it's been raining so it's all closed on my balcony and um, it's sticky though the humidity is always there but I feel good because yesterday I exercised in the bathroom there on the floor it has such a space and I could put my camera there the webcam at least on the table so it's a new place that I discovered I could exercise and it was really good but really it was like uh, in a sauna but at least I know I could take a bath or shower right away so that's a new discovery for me to do my exercise in and uh, two days ago also I did here yeah. so I feel good even though today I spent all day practically in bed had breakfast and no but lunch I did go outside uh, downstairs so dinner as usual I have uh, in my bedroom because you know it's just you know, so practical and comfortable and cozy I have it here no, and the food placed there on the table so okay I hope you enjoy my video this vlog this time again I'm doing it as regular as possible and as frequent as possible so hope you enjoyed see you on my next video if any suggestion just uh, write below comment below and please hit that button subscribe subscription okay talk to you soon bye